Hey guys, so this is Simon Lovell here and I want to take your fitness studio to the next level and I want to talk about a topic that I think that we all can relate with which is procrastination, not really getting shit done in your fitness business. Maybe you've been training all day and you have a chunk of time you find yourself scrolling through the Facebook newsfeed, looking at what other people are doing and not getting the results that you want, even though you really think that you want it. Well, here's the first thing. If you're procrastinating, then the first thing to understand is that you don't have a clear vision on exactly what to do. So it means that you don't understand something. OK, so education is the key. OK, you know, if we want to send, you know, an email promotion out, but you don't know what to send, then you're going to start procrastinating and not fully understanding what to do. Also, you need to chunk what you're doing. Maybe you've got a list of things to do. And so you're overwhelmed by that and you don't know where to start because you're not clear about the outcome. And that's another thing also. Um, if you're spending too much time, you know, watching TV, using social media, maybe you just are unclear of the, the direction you're going in. It's a deeper purpose thing. And so it's all about intention, knowing where you're going and your higher purpose, particularly for, um, particularly for guys. That's really important. Uh, uh, no uh, discount to the uh, ladies watching also. That's very important too. So procrastination you're always going to get triggered by different things, but it's about clearing away the clutter and having a clear set of action steps and most of all, a reason why. You can have a list of re things that you want to do on a daily basis, but if there's no attachment, if there's no absolute reason why this has to be a must. So for example, if you want to earn three grand a month and you're at two or you want to earn 10 grand a month or you're at five, what's the reason that the earning the 10K a month is an absolute must? When that gets so locked in emotionally that it's linked to your children, Children, it's linked to the things that you really want to do, then understand that the procrastination will start to drop as you start to drive towards that. If you've been locked in the same income bracket, and I've talked about this on videos before, and you're not moving forward, maybe you've lost your drive, maybe you've lost your motivation, maybe you've lost your mojo because you've been doing this for so long. It's been just the same, the same, the same. But understand that you can get a mentor, a coach to help you, to guide you through this, just as if someone comes into the studio and they're asking you to go from A to B and you say, and you know the quickest route because you've been through the training, you can see what's ahead. You know, when a child plays a video game and the parent comes along, then inevitably the, ch the child wins, not because they're the best technically on the, on the pad, but because they've seen what's ahead. And so I understand that as a trainer, as someone who owns a studio, your passion is with training people, but understand that the business skills, the sales, the marketing skills, getting skilled in that area and, more, and having more knowledge in that area is going to give you more clarity. And when you start to get results and you see progression, the procrastination will drop because you're getting momentum. At the moment, if you're procrastinating, you're not in momentum and we need to get you in momentum. And that can be from mini breakthroughs, from making a different package sale, from getting some clients in through a promotion, through setting up a system, a system to your marketing. If it's haphazard at the moment and you're doing stuff willy nilly and it's not really getting any results, then the next time you go to do something, you're going to procrastinate because you associate the same outcome as what you did before, i.e. I did this before, I didn't get the result. If you knew from the list of the 10 things that you had to do today that you would get a specific result from the action that you took, which would result in you getting a holiday, getting your new car, getting a new house, I guarantee you that procrastination would drop at least by 50%. Um, and also your environment, who you're around, just by going out into a different environment and not staying in the gym and working and getting out into a coffee shop is just going to put you in a different frame of mind. It's going to uh, tap into more of your creative space to enable you to do that. So there are a few uh, tips on procrastination. Listen, if you want to take your fitness business to the next level, then click the link below, fill out the form, and uh, you can apply for your free fitness business strategy session where we can take your fitness business and put it on steroids in the next, next 30 days. Take it easy, and I will see you in another video.